Good morning guys, happy Saturday! Normal services resumed, I'm doing a weekend vlog. I, I'd like to say I've got the whole weekend off. I don't, I'm off today. I'm doing some overtime tomorrow, as you can tell. Just been outside and done a run. I got up at quarter past seven, met my friend and we went for a lovely run, did about seven miles. The sun is shining, it's really cold on the fingers, but I went out dressed like this and I was more than um, comfortable. It was gorgeous running down the canal this morning. Um, yeah, so a really lovely start to the morning. Harry is back at swimming, so that's where he is just is David right now. Emily's still in bed. Um, what have we got planned for today? Meeting some family for once. So we're going to go out for a drink. Couldn't get a table, but I didn't really try very hard in different, lots of different places. So we're just going to go to the back garden. My brother's got a pizza oven so in the garden, so he's going to make us some wood-fired pizzas. And we're just going to have a very nice time. As for the rest of the day, what we've got planned? Not so sure. Been busy working this weekend, um, this weekend, all week. Obviously went to Alton Towers, which you saw. Um, if you haven't seen the Alton Towers video, we will leave a link to wherever I was supposed to leave a link. Um, please go and check it out. We had such an amazing time at Alton Towers. I really enjoyed vlogging in theme parks again. I feel like I've improved a lot by doing these weekend vlogs. Me personally, I don't care for those people that gave me the thumbs down. Um, I really enjoyed vlogging at Alton Towers. We had an amazing time and I can't wait, get, can't wait to get back to Disney to get behind the camera again and give it another go. Yeah, last trip we were still learning, still learning now, and um, but just had an awesome time. So please, if you want to check out that video, please give us a thumbs up. I'm gonna get some breakfast now because I am starving. Like I said, seven mile run, bit of a 15 minute hit workout, um, just to try and fit bit of strength in and then yeah, coffee needed a lot. I'm gonna go and make that. So we had a delivery of Joffrey's this week. Look what we've got. We've got some classic blends, we've got some Kona blends, French Bistro, what else have we got? Oh can't balance it at the same time. We've got some Riviera and ah all the stuff's falling off. And some Tusker House coffee. Thanks Harry. Welcome. So what should we have David? Big one. Uh, Tusker. Go for Tusker House, right. Go for a Tusker House blend. The one right at the back. I like, I like Tusker House. So, Tusker House. I want to go to Tusker House. Morning. I was swimming. Good. Did you have a good time? Mm -hmm. Did you do lots and lots of lens? Did she make you work really hard? Uh, actually, she didn't because she knew we hadn't done swimming in ages. So, so apparently today we did like a little bit of practice and she came over to the adult department according to dad and said we're going to do it very, very hard next week. Oh my goodness, you're going to push it hard. Harry's got a really tough swimming teacher, haven't you? Yes. Right, you go and get your breakfast. All dressed and ready, had a shower, feels so much better. Um, just heading into the garden centre just to see if they've got something that we want. Um, and Crazy Grandad wants an indoor watering can. Um, yeah, then we're going to go pick some bits up from the shops and head to my brother's. It's a beautiful day out here this morning. Um, clear blue skies, not a cloud in the sky. Um, yeah, I've still got my big coat on. I've not got a jumper on today though, so that's good. I probably will get a bit hot in this though. But better to be safe than sorry. <laughs> right, I'm going to go to the garden centre. So we've come to the garden centre to pick up a crazy granddad a watering can and this is the selection. We've got a frog with a crown, a toucan, a llama, a pink frog, an elephant, a penguin. I'm not quite sure how easily that would pour. A flamingo. I think we should get in the flamingo. A duck <laughs> and a swan. Oh and some unicorns. What is wrong with a normal watering can? I'll we'll have to get him a big one. Is that $9.99? we get him one of those red ones. It's a bit big though, isn't it? What do you reckon? I know what I'd choose, but... I like the elephant, to be honest. I think the, the paw on that would be quite good. Just sat outside in the garden, got to my brother's house. Won't be doing much filming. I don't think they want to be filmed in the vlog. But sun is shining, the drinks are going to be flowing, and lovely, lovely pizza in my tummy.
How's the pizza, boys? Good. Good. Is it really nice? Looks amazing. Harry, got a bit of sauce. Other side. And a bit of flour. Mm. Yeah. Oh, that pizza smells incredible. Just got home from my brother's, had an amazing time. It was so lovely to catch up with my brother and my sister-in-law. Pizza was amazing. Yeah, I can't say anything less than that. Obviously the kids and David had like cheese and tomato with mozzarella, which was incredible as well. And we had like fennel seeds and sausage and oh, it was so good. And I am not a huge pizza fan. I don't do Domino's or Pizza Hut, but those wood fired pizzas are amazing. So we had a, a lovely time. It was so lovely catching up with family. Obviously didn't film them because they don't want to be on the vlog, which is fine. Um, it was just nice just catching up and just having a chat, having a few drinks. Obviously afternoon drinking has made me very, very tired. I am so tired now. Ready for bed. I'm gonna chill out for the rest of the evening, watch a bit of telly, and that's about it really. Yeah, really good day. Got very quickly, but an amazing day. Um, not sure what we're gonna watch. Probably watch a bit of Chernobyl. We got given um, Now TV Entertainment, because we've got Now TV movie package, and we haven't been watching it at all during the latter part of this, well, at all during this lockdown. Just no new movies on there we wanted to watch. So they've given us Now TV Entertainment for a month. I think they realise we're going to cancel because we've not watched. And that's why we're give, giving us the entertainment package. So we're just watching Chernobyl. Very far behind everybody else because obviously, obviously everybody else watched it over a year ago. Really good. Really, really, really good series. So it breaks it up a bit from Grey's Anatomy because 17 seasons of Grey's back to back is a little bit intense so it's nice to uh, break it up a little bit um yeah david's just pottering in the garden for a minute we're just planting some grass seed so that's what he's doing now and then we're gonna watch a bit of telly and just chill for the rest of the night and then i've got to get up tomorrow for work up at half five doing some overtime Woohoo! yeah but it's an overtime shift you know when you agree to it weeks ago and then regret it yeah, that's kind of how I'm feeling right now. But all is good. It's worth the cause. Helping out the girls as well as making some money. So yeah, all positive. So that's pretty much it for the rest of the night. If I do anything exciting, I'll let you know. See you in a bit. Good morning. Happy Sunday. Happy weary Sunday. Early ferry very early. Well, it's just after six and I'm shattered. I could have cried when my alarm clock went off this morning. I'm showered, I'm dressed. Coffee, just needed. Why did I agree to the overtime? I could actually cry. I'm like, yeah, I agreed to this overtime weeks ago and I was like, yeah, be fair. I have worked so much over the last eight days, I can't even begin to tell you. And then without Alton Towers thrown in the mix. Yesterday was my only true day off, I spent it out all day. Did chill out, it was amazing seeing the family again, but oh god I'm exhausted. Just made my lunch, so I'm not sure if I... I mentioned in the Alton Towers vlog that I've just started to do the body coach. So I signed up to the body coach, Leaning 15, well it's not Leaning 15 anymore, sorry, the body coach app. Um, the old method was like, method was leaning 15. Um, so I signed up to the app because it was on a free trial and now I'm doing it for the rest of the month. I'll see how it goes. I'm only paying monthly, which is the most expensive way to pay, but then I can cancel it if I don't want to stick to it. But I have to stick to it so far and I'm doing really well. I've had a couple of off days, which is fine. That's life. So yesterday, obviously, I had a few cheeky cocktails and pizza. Obviously pizza is not on plan, but this is what I'm having for my breakfast. So I made these a couple of days ago and I froze them. Just come out of the freezer. They don't look much, but they're really nice. They're courgette um, muffins basically, with, made with egg and cheese and they have got pumpkin seeds on the top. And then this is my salmon salad. The salmon salad is not a specific recipe but basically it's high fat, 
low carbs. So that's what basically that is. Obviously salmon's really good for you, full of high good fats and there's absolutely really zero carbs in there apart from the cucumber. Does cucumber even count? No. But these muffin things are actually really good. Mm. Basically, it's like a cold omelette or cold quiche without a crust. That's what it is. Yeah, quicheless crust. Crustless quiche, even. God, I'm tired. Right, if I get this lot packed away in my bag and get to work. So I'll see you guys when I get home. It's not a full day today. It's just, well, I say it's not a full day. It's still an eight hour shift, but it's not a full day for me. I'll be home around about half, around about three o'clock. Harry's got a party to go to. David's got some jobs to do in the garden. And I'll see you when I get home. Good afternoon, guys. It's now Sunday afternoon. I am home from work. Working all right, not too bad. I've just got changed, about to do a hit workout because we went to a barbecue. So yeah, we're gonna have fun having a barbecue. Need to burn it though, kind of. So I'm just doing a bit of a hit workout before I have the barbecue. So I'm gonna best get cracking. So I can go and enjoy some of the nice weather. had a shower after my hip workout and we're just chilling out in the garden aren't we? Yep. Harry's back from his party. Have a good time? Yep. What were you up to? Hot tub, trampoline, mini hot dogs. Hot dogs, good. amazing. Oh, that sounds like a great party for you. Yep. Perfect party. Just sat in the garden chilling. The barbecue is lit. My birthday party. Um, and then we're going to play a couple of rounds of Uno while we just chill out. It's um, nice isn't it? Yeah. And it wasn't my birthday. It's not your birthday, no. no. Well, I think they know that because otherwise we would have celebrated your birthday. Oh, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. Back to school tomorrow? Yep. Oh, did you see I've got you some new clothes? Yep. No, yeah. I haven't. Actually. I was super, super organised and ordered them yesterday. Yeah, so you just need to try those on before you go back to school. Oh, and Emily's just brought me a glass of wine. Emily, that come in the Cheers. vlog. <sighs> a big guy, right? So, just got the sausages on the barbecue and the burgers. Just a little barbecue today. I did buy chicken and lamb because my brother and my sister-in-law were supposed to be coming to our house yesterday. Um, but they wanted to stay at home, which is fine because um, they don't drive. So it's a little bit tricky for them to get here. So we've got loads of meat, but we have just chowed down on loads of crisps. So we're just having these and some bread buns. Oh, bad place to stand. So Harry said, when you have a barbecue, isn't it when your sausages are burnt? So don't burn the sausages. Never criticise the chef if you're not willing to do it yourself. I'm going to go and play double. <laughs> Has anyone played this game? It is such a fun game to play. There are like several different types that you play. It's basically a little oh. bit like Snap. So you get given all these cards, don't you, Harry? Yep. And then you have to, what do you have to do? So, if you have a card yourself, and if you have one symbol that's on there, you need to try and guess it really quick. So you have to fa fastest first, so, so one, two, three. No entry. Yeah. And apparently... So it's quite hard. It's really hard. Every card has a match. And you yeah. think they don't have a match, but they do. So you've got like eight symbols on a card and every card has a match. And also, so when you find out you're like, you find one, someone else finds it. Yeah, so you've got, it's you the don't... fastest, it's the, there's about seven different games within it, but basically it's all the same thing. You've got to, first person to find the symbol to match. Uh, you can either be like, whoever's got the most cards at the end of it or whoever got, gets rid of their cards first. And Many different sure. types. So Harry and I are just going to have a quick game with this. Right. Three. Two, two, one, go. Horse. Go oh, you. What did I get? What did I get? Right. Okay. Three, two, one. Horse. Oh, what? I did. How can is that look, even possible? Can I look what I have? Three, go on. Cheese. Okay. Lovely sausage. Lovely burger. Cheese. And loads of burger sauce. Hmm. Back from my run now, I have went for about 
how far did I go? Four and a half miles, four and a half miles. Um, did a couple of weights inside. Um, just gonna have some breakfast. Um, having a coffee. Got the cafetiere. Uh, it's not a cafetiere, what is the name of it? Anyway, the coffee machine on the go. I've got a nice Starbucks going on. And I have cooking um, some French toast. So it's the Body Coach recipe app. And I've got some French toast on the go. Let me show you. Cinnamon French toast. Oh, not sure I was supposed to do that. <laughs> All 100. I think that needs a little bit longer, that side. But it smells amazing. So a few weeks ago, I signed up to the Body Coach app because they were doing a, he was doing a trial for seven free days. Not seven, five. Seven to three days. I thought I'd give it a go. Um, I then sort of like signed up to a month. Um, so I am trying so hard to stick to it. Obviously having a few off days at the weekends if I'm off. Um, I'm really, really trying so hard. And then I get a bit, little bit demotivated if I have like a couple glasses of wine and stuff. This is what we call a refuel, refuel meal. You're supposed to have it after you've worked out or done some exercise. I'm not sure if I'm gonna renew it again for another month because I'm only paying monthly at the minute. The yearly subscription was just, a, yeah, I'm not sure. I've done it before, but on my own, not with any apps and stuff. I just, I don't feel like I need that level. I don't get anything extra from it. So I'm paying like 15 pounds a month. Sorry, I need to take this French toast off. Um, yeah, I'm getting, I'm not sure I'll get more money's worth from it. So I don't always follow the recipes. I like play around with them a bit. So I think if I just uh, adopt the philosophy and not pay for it, I think that's where I'm leading to. But we'll see, I'll give it a go. Um, nine days till check-in, till I start cycle two. Um, yeah, and see where we go from there, really. I'm gonna have this French toast in the garden because it's almost 11 o'clock and the garden is lovely and loads of sunshine. Well, a little spot in the garden anyway. All showered and dressed in the car, just doing some shopping. Nipped to Waitrose, only nipped in for some pizza, ended up spending £15. <laughs> I also went in to look for some Little Moons. Now, Emily's been after these Little Moons forever. And the cheers is, seem to have got them. I don't know how many times. They must be like, have loads in their local area. But in this local, in here, around here, they don't seem to have any. Um, so that is what I'm trying to find for Em, because she really, really wants them. And I really want to try them as well. Um, so just doing a bit, quick bit of shopping, been to Waitrose, going to knit to Asda and then Aldi as well. So doing all the shops in the local area. <laughs> Exciting Monday round here. Uh. Home from the shops now, just chilling in the garden, about to have my lunch. I have got a lovely chicken tikka kebab salad. Oh, I can't wait to eat it. And a little bit of a Diet Coke. Yeah, look at this. How good does that look? Kids are home from school. I'm just chilling in the garden, getting the last few minutes of those gorgeous sun rays, all that vitamin D. Probably moving in a minute because obviously I'm now in the shade. Um, I just want to announce before I forget the winner of our 1000 subscriber giveaway. Um, the winner is Nicole White. Uh, we've already contacted Nicole and she has accepted the gift or our giveaway. Um, we have already sent her a, a t-shirt in the post. So we ordered it online and that is making the way to her. Just need to post the rest of the stuff. Um, slight miscommunication between David and I. I thought the t-shirt was arriving here. So I was waiting for that to box up the rest of the, um, the giveaway surprise. So apologies, Nicole, if you're watching this. The giveaway is on its way to you, but I'll drop you an email to let you know anyway. The rest of the evening, just usual after school stuff really. Um, making some dinner, bath, bed and line of duty. Because last night we completely forgot line of duty was on. I don't know how we managed that. And I've kept away from Twitter and Facebook and everywhere, so no spoilers out there. Um, yeah, so line of duty is gonna be what we're watching tonight. Obviously a bit of greys, maybe, but we've also started watching The Flight Attendant on um, Sky. So that was really good. So we'll probably be about three, three or four episodes into that. So that's been a brilliant um, little series as well. So 
Our night of telly is all sorted. So that's going to be it for today's weekly vlog, or the end of the weekly vlog, if you play a weekend vlog or whatever it is. Um, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this weekly vlog. Don't forget to give, to give us a big thumbs up. Leave some comments down below. Let us know you're watching. And thanks for watching again next week. Bye.